Hey everyone, Brian Balon here, and I want to make a quick video for you guys about something that happened to one of my listings this week. But something to look out for that when you're selling your house, that uh, you know, in this particular case, if it's this applies to you, that you could look out for it so that when you're ready to sell, this doesn't happen to you. So uh, the situation is a seller has, uh, well, actually, her mom, who is now deceased as of 2007, um, and, and the daughter, who is now the seller. They were on a, a deed together, and uh, in 07, mother passed away. Uh, city of Phoenix went, you know, so they went through the whole uh, probate thing with City of Phoenix, and um, yeah, I mean, the problem was though is that they have some of the documents today, uh, some of those documents from the the process of the probate, uh, they they don't have. So what it's showing on the county recorders, uh, the, which is basically the uh, official uh, documents that gives notice to the world of what the status of the home is, who owns it, if there are any liens on it, um, how the, the deed was taken, how ownership of the property was taken. Um, the, that county recorders uh, database, which is public record, uh, shows for my particular seller that the mother, again, who's now deceased for as of like 10 years ago, and the seller, and the, who is a daughter, are both still on the deed. So in order for them to sell it, there's two things that need to happen. One, both parties, the mother and the daughter, need to sign off on the sale of the home, or there needs to be proof of some kind that the death happened and that the transfer of the property occurred through probate. So now I'm in a situation with a title company that we're working with to prove that, because right now the county recorder is saying that... Um, that both the mother and the daughter uh, are owners of the property. So we need to resolve that. And the thing is that this thing closes in like two weeks. So, you know, and, and it's not necessarily sure that the process went through probate because the seller doesn't know. So quick tip for you before you sell your home, if you have a situation where you own a property that you inherited, uh, that one that it shows on the county recorder's website, and there is a document that's uploaded there. There's images from like 1880 something. It's coming crazy. I haven't even looked that far, but that's what they claim. Something in the late 1800s they have documentation for. But check the county recorder and see if your document is reflecting that you as a seller or your spouse, you know, you and your spouse are the owners of the property post, um, you know, will or uh, heir. You know, I guess if uh, there's a deceased parent or family member that has uh, willed you or is giving you a property when they pass away that you are now on that deed on your own. So just want to give you that quick tip and actually have another client that uh, has a similar situation. Father passed away. They've inherited the property, want to sell it. So I'll check in with them about that. But I uh, want to give you guys that tip so that you are really prepared to sell your home when the time comes. Hope you're having a good one. Happy Easter weekend and we'll see you soon.